My wife's currently away visiting family. She'll be back this evening. I thought, why not surprise her with the world's biggest pillow fort movie night? I do have a little secret though. I've actually never built a pillow fort before. So I thought, why not just get all the blankets and pillows that I can together, including Dane and Salvatore for some reason, and then get some lunch and figure it out because I had no clue what to do. After consulting the pillow fort pros, AKA Google, it looks like the best thing to get would be a clothesline. I can then hang the blankets from that. And I think to hold the blankets together, I can just get pegs, the pegs that keep the bag of crisps close, you know, that kind of thing. Like I said, I'm a newbie at this, so please don't judge me too hard. Mm. I've got no idea what to do here. First off, I say we get this rope and we build an outline of the kind of thing we want. So I want the fork to end around here so she has to go around the island and we'll make the entryway over here. I think over here we want to do a little seating area. The main event is going to be the living area over here, so I'm going to line this whole thing with pillows, blankets, all that kind of stuff. It's all going to be coloured, so that means I need to find out lighting. What if we do soft boxes that I use to film my YouTube videos? And we can do the soft boxes facing downwards, so it's kind of more accent lighting instead of right in your face. And they can hold up the blankets as well. Yes, yes, yes. And that can attach to here. Oh my gosh. Yes. Good boy, Sam. Yes. I have all the ingredients to build the perfect pillow fort now. However, talking of building, we're building a couple of houses for Airbnb currently and I have to go to one of them to choose the countertops right now and Sunny's gonna have a good old run around in the back garden. So let's go there and I'll give you a quick update on what's going on with them. Woodland Reserve has gone through some major changes in the last couple of months. We've demoed the whole interior, got rid of the orange kitchen, the floors are gone. We enlisted some help from some great friends to do the landscaping. The color of the property has changed from brown to this gorgeous white with black trim now. Replaced the roof, new HVAC system, new hot water heater, whole house softener. There's been so much stuff we've done in the last couple of months, including throwing a machete 25 foot or so up to Lucas in a tree. That was fun. And our new build property called Marshview is finally done. We just need to furnish it. We are so excited. And here's my mother-in-law's thoughts on our new staircase. This is class. I can see myself falling down the steps. Oh. I hope you enjoyed the quick house update. I've been waiting around for 45 minutes and no one showed. So uh, I'm going to go home. Let's build this pillow fort. So with this, that, that, and I think for one more, we're going to do there to the top of the hinge on the other side of that door. The strings are finally done. Let's get started with the blankets. Oh, Sonny, what have I got myself into with this? I think I just chuck and hope, right? It held! What I figured out I can do is put string between these two strings, kind of like a shoelace, and that'll help hold everything up. It's slowly coming together. I've got about an hour and a half until Monica gets home. Hopefully I can get it done in time. I think I will be able to. Okay, I finished the basic outline of the pillow fort. Let me get you a better view. Oh my word, look at this. <laughs> I'm about half an hour left and I officially have a pillow fort. Now it's time to decorate it. It's fully finished. Hey Sunny, do you approve? I think we should give a tour, right? Three, two, one. Welcome to our pillow fort. <laughs> oh my word. So we have the cozy area here. This is where Sunny's been snuggling, isn't it? If you sit down in the cozy area, <laughs> firstly, you get a crazy puppy coming up and giving you lots of loving. Secondly, if you look up, look at that. Do you want to show your area over there with all your toys? Let's go see. So this is Sonny's little hideaway area. He's got all his toys in here, don't you, buddy? <laughs> He's got his own little exit over there, as you can see. 9.17, 11 minutes. 11 minutes until you get home. I cannot wait. Let me know when you are arriving. I'll come and meet you out in the hallway, my love. It all boils down to this. I haven't seen my wife in four days. I've spent the entire four days working, literally non-stop. But I'm so glad I got some free time to do this today. Are you ready? <gasps> Who is that? <laughs> Are you gonna say if I see a husband? Hi. 
Oh my. Samuel Charles Simpson Patterson. <laughs> Did you guys This is do what that? we've been doing all you day. Yes, but you he did. He's so excited to show you as well. This is a giant pillow fort, Samuel. baby. Oh my. So let me introduce you oh. to our pillow forts. <laughs> show me. I'm getting kisses. Show me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm sleeping in here tonight. <laughs> so. <laughs> you set this up? He set it all oh up. I just watched. And Sonny wants to show you. He has his own bedroom in here. <laughs> Bedroom? You have a bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> Do we just have a three-way kitchen? That was so cute. <laughs> Holy moly! So I'm guessing we're watching like a movie. We're having a movie night. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you're insane. Awesome. This must have taken ages. So we relaxed, had a cuddle, had some dinner together, and dessert is served. Damn. <laughs> Sam! <laughs> Sam! <laughs> oh my actual gosh! <laughs> I feel like I'm like getting engaged. Will you marry me? Yes! Yes! Do you hear that, bud? I'm getting married! That was such a fun video to film. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe and thank you for watching.